hintay kayo naghanap ako na maganda. Do not be in hurry. Executive Secretary Salvador Mijaldia, Lieutenant General Ricardo Visaya, and other major service command, Lieutenant General Glorioso Miranda, Lieutenant General Eduardo Año, General Manager Eddie Monreal, Police Chief Superintendent Mauranda Aplaska, my fellow workers in government, my countrymen. Tamad akong magsalita, basahin ko. May basahin dyan? Basahin ko na lang yung iyo. Ganun mo lang yan. Upon the invitation of His Excellency, President Chan Dei Kwan, I am leaving for Hanoi for a two-day official visit to the Socialist Republic of Vietnam. For the past 40 years, the Philippines and Vietnam have fostered a strong relationship built on a common desire towards achieving greater peace and prosperity anchored on the basic tenets of sovereign equality, non-interference, and peaceful settlement of disputes. On this introductory visit to Hanoi, I look forward to renewing the ties of friendship between the Philippines and Vietnam and affirm the commitment to work closer to achieve shared goals for our countries and peoples. I look forward to exchange views and explore opportunities further significantly improving our economic bilateral cooperation including stronger partnership in economic, agriculture, defense, and maritime operation. We will seek to identify emerging areas of partnership, particularly in the fields of maritime security and law enforcement. We shall also seek the ways to advance collaboration in the campaign against illegal drug trade consistent with the global of realizing an ASEAN drug-free community. We will work with Vietnam and the rest of the ASEAN in suppressing the proliferation of illegal drugs for us to secure a better future for our generations and the generations to come. As maritime nations with rapidly developing economies, we acknowledge the convergence of our strategic interest, broadening cooperation and collaboration between the Philippines and Vietnam, and solidifying our strategic partnership to further strengthen our countries in the regions which we belong to. The visit is significant in that it takes place as the Philippines and Vietnam commemorate 40 years of diplomatic relations as both countries prepared to take leadership in the roles of the region in 2017. The Philippines, as it chairs the ASEAN, and Vietnam, as it chairs APIC. I shall endeavor to work closely with my counterparts in Vietnam in order to fully realize the objectives we share. Upon my return, I will report on the accomplishment of what may we gain, particularly in the key bilateral issues impacting our relations. I am confident that as we build on the outcomes of this visit, the relations between the Philippines and Vietnam will become even more stronger, pursued as it has to be with mutual respect, closer cooperation, and deeper understanding. Maraming salamat po.